2024 heat wave sent me the first package of the year i think yeah this is the first package they sent me of the year and it happens to be i think an rc car <laughs> super stoked justin even wrote me a hand handwritten letter some super sentimentals in there i love that guy <laughs> pretty excited anyways um yeah this is dope charger for it which is what gave it away let's check out what they hooked it up with sheesh i know dancy is gonna love this thing for sure yeah this thing is sweet Look at that. The Heat Wave Eisenhower Brothers Baja Ray 2.0. Is that, did I say that right? Here she is. I've been wanting one of these things. This thing is fucking sick. I don't even know why I want one. Like I need something else to do, but still. That's it. Thanks, dudes. Eisenhower Brothers Heat Wave. Baja truck. This thing's fucking dope. Gonna go play around. It's hella fun. <laughs> we bought this big old voltage fucking Dutchman toy hauler, 10 foot garage, sliding glass door. All right, left work a little early. The voltage is off to its new home, gone. Short and sweet. Big dog. Quick YouTube fucking transaction. Here you go. Yeah, All right, brother. Congra you. Congratulations. Have a good one, Hopefully man. you and your family have fun with this thing all summer. Oh, we will. All right, cool. All right. Drive safe. <laughs> Unique towing. Came soup some cash for me. They're going to pick up a truck in San Pablo for me and bringing it to my house. I'm driving the 7.3 while my truck is getting tuned up and fixed and these guys are, I'm getting a project. Picking up cash and getting a new truck today. Y'all see it later. All right, people, random project I came up on Facebook Marketplace. 7.3 diesel two-wheel drive manual it looks bad in here but it ain't that bad to be honest i've had way worse um short bed converted from a long bed to a short bed because they don't make these in short beds obviously bed needs more body work and paint i'll probably buy a whole new bed for that that thing's fucked but wheels are for sale because i'm gonna slam this thing so they're useless to me. Those are getting sold. 8 by 170 20x10s 20 on 33s, if anyone's interested in some 33s for their Ford. But this thing has steez. It's going to be, has potential. You just don't know it. Once it's slammed on the fucking ground, it's going to be sick. Came with the fucking stocks. Some random steelies. And a random axle that I don't fucking need. So if anyone scraps metal that wants an axle, they can come get this thing. I don't know what it is. Don't know what it came off of. It's a six lug. Might be good for a little Yoda crawler or something. I have no idea what it is, but who wants it? Junk. I can see it now. This thing's like all that gone. Just bam. All right, motherfuckers, 
We are in uh, the Chinks LP5, motherfuckers. GMC boys. It's a Chevy, though. Never fucking forget it. Chevy boys. And we are going to Salinas to buy another Clapper 7.3. We took off work. We said, fuck the shop right now. Uh, we had a bunch of people picking up today, but no one wanted to actually grab them. So we made sure that no one was going to get left stranded and behind. And we took off for the day. So the shop is closed. And I'm getting another 7.3 like I always do. We are off. All right, YouTube took the wheels off that cheap ass truck I bought yesterday, sold the wheels. Congrats, dude, thank you for thank also you. making that quick and easy. That truck's gonna get sold tonight because I'm over it already, overnight. And I bought another one today, and that truck's for sale. I'll post about that in a second. All right, well, I did not wanna deal with this project. There it goes. I did not want to deal with this, and these guys did, so. <laughs> See you gone. Phew! Good luck. <laughs> I would say, <laughs> I would say tail light warranty on this situation, but. There ain't no tail lights. <laughs> they gone. What are you cleaning up, dude? Blood. Fuck. The crime scene's been fucking cleaned up already, but let me see that hand. Can you see if it's squirting? Don't get me in the eye. Oh, we're good, dude. Good? Keep that fucking thing on there tight. Good? I already stopped the bleeding. Nerd. That is fucking chunky flesh on that drill bit. Bro, that's... That's white meat. That's <laughs> That is white meat. My guy just drilled right through his fucking hand. Uh, my god bro i want to say thank you to rich from house of thunder harley davidson he hooked me up with this white tailgate off one of their old trucks for my new truck uh, using connections people i know to get the shit that i need just gonna wipe off all these stickers if you don't know trick to the trade these rubber wheels i go on a drill bit will get off all gummy sticky gooey shit off trucks cars all the shit you don't want stuck on the paint this is the way to go but check it out Let's show how it works. Instead of sitting there picking out the stickers forever, this takes it right off. Makes a mess, but it's a lot easier than picking. Uh, uh, fresh drop off. Margie's dropping off the fucking dreamsicle. Sheesh, good to see in the light. Let's take a look. Freshy. Get that thing out of there, Mark. Come on, man. I've been known. I've been known to do a thing. Yeah. Oh yeah, she looks cherry loo, brother. Oh yeah. Nice fresh upgrade. It looks really good. Come on, little fella. Oh, sorry, dance. Shoo. That thing is the sauce boss. All right, people, here she is. The Triple Five Designs Refresh always takes care of me. She is looking clean. Baron Suspension out of Morgan Hill, or Gilroy, sorry. Uh, hooked it up again. I needed seals, and he revalved my rear shock. Um, new graphic kit. New Thrill Seeker seat. The hostility hits on it. Clean. Probably leave their badge on it this time. All the day one homies right here. Never fuck it up. That's the shit right there. This is also the shit. Marky, good job, dude. Oh, looks oh. looks great. 303 for the homie Ryan Lowe, if you don't know. My dog. Super clean, all orange front fender. Repping for the boy right there too. Forever 14.9. Dang. Look pro goes slow, right, Marky? Is that what they say? Look pro goes slow. Hell yeah. Uh, you, don't be going, you don't be going that slow though. 
Yeah, I'm pretty, I'm decent. I'm good with it. I can go, all right. All right, so I got the three inch leveling kit for this truck today. About to, normally I pay to install it, but it's winter time, it's cold. We ain't got shit to do tonight. So I'm gonna do it myself. Um, I used to do it by myself actually. And then I started paying fools to do it because I get charged like 500 bucks to install it. And my time is worth more than the 500 bucks. But today I ain't got shit to do. So I'm going to spend 500 bucks on my time and do it myself and see how it comes out. Super raked out in the back right now. So three inches more in the front should look pretty good. And then I got wheels and tires coming for it. And that's pretty much it. Gonna throw some off-road looking lights in the grill. And this is the new dirt bike rig. Little $6,000 manual 7.3. Gotta love these things. Random little deal here, sold the tailgate. Almost perfect color for his truck. Anyways, that F-150 tailgate, that was like gold, came on this truck. Oh shit, hey, hey, came on this truck. Rich hooked me up with this newer tailgate, which looks awesome. And that guy just got that tailgate. And I hooked him up with new tail lights and third light just to hook him up. All right, little Friday special. This guy came in with his old bike he doesn't want anymore and I, I bought it. I just have an issue. I just buy too much shit. Anyways, so what happened? Friday, we're about to leave. Someone rolls in with a good deal and Sure enough, I fucking buy it. Unbelievable. Show you it here in a second. All right, Fra Friday night special. <laughs> Get down. Literally Friday night special, another one. And she's for sale. <laughs> 94? Yeah, hard mount. Ready to fucking chop it right here. Hard tail the bitch. Sportster Frisco undersized tank i put a little 1.2 gallon jonathan on here rake the fucking front end narrow the front fucking narrow glide front end get rid of that club style fucking t-sport fairing throw it in the fucking trash give them some v-bend uh apes or whatever you want to call them chopper bars here are the gauges you gotta keep those damn look at those those are fucking those are sick highway fuck Ooh. all right me and the boys josh sent it all day today and we went rode dirt bikes at Avenal. Top secret location. Yeah, pissed off my wife, but came home and showed her her Valentine's gift early. And I got myself a, a gift. So 18s are going on the 7.3, 18 KMC beadlocks with Falcon Wild Peak Rough RTs, Rough Terrains. And then Melissa is getting the 20 by 10 beadlocks on 35 inch AT4's Falcons. It's their new like all-terrain tire. Pretty aggressive and still streetable. My shit's gonna be stupid sick on this piece of shit 7.3. But balling. Looking good. All right, sold. This guy did not sleep. He came on Monday like he said he would, bought it. Everyone else that was talking about this thing, asking me if the paint was perfect and if it had any scratches and all that nonsense. For $2,000, he got a running riding sportster. Of course, there's scratches. Of course, the seat is ripped, but two grand? Come on. Congrats, dude. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. On to the next. All right, what up, everyone? We realized that um, I did not film anything else after we leveled this truck that you saw, so I leveled it. Wheels and tires are on, added like four of these lights. Did a bunch of shit. This is gonna be my dirt bike rig. Um, bought it in the time being while my truck has been at Hot Shot Motorsports in Fresno getting paint match and everything. And then I fell in love with this thing. So just gonna keep it as a side daily. Um, and I know the video's gonna look like it's all over the place cause we started working on this thing in the shop and then at my house and we were on it until like midnight and then we forgot to film anything. So. Anyways, here's the finished product of this truck. Pretty much, I'm gonna change out the steps and straight pipe it. I'm gonna put the like rock bash guards on there 
and then do some uh do a straight pipe but here she is three and a half inch leveling kit programmer from uh edge products she's dope it's my favorite one of my favorite trucks i've ever had right here surprisingly enough all right what up youtube dudes and gals that are watching give you a little rundown of the bikes that we got going on uh you got six days left to win all these bikes on two different websites uh slabsize.com um, is giving away this 92 fxr uh, it is fully customized fresh paint job mccuni carburetor thunderheader saddleman seat um, ready to go lindall brakes performance machine rear caliper and with lindall rotors things pretty sick this thing's ready to go. Jump on it, go anywhere you want. Take a look at it. Uh, next bike we're giving away is a 1950 title, California title pan shovel. Uh, you have six days left to win this bike also on slabsize.com. Every $1 is one entry. So you have your choice between these two bikes or 10,000 in cash. You can take your choice. You either pick a motorcycle or take home cash, whatever you want. Uh, this bike is a matching number pan head bottom end shovel head top end, ratchet shifter, um, pretty dope. And then, if you want to get on hostilityinc.com, every order gets you entered to win this bike only for this month. So there's also six days left. This only ran for one month. We might do one month giveaways for dirt bikes more often or subscriber counts on our YouTube. So make sure you subscribe to this channel. Um, the next giveaway might just be based off of subscriptions. So. Uh, this bike is a 2008 KTM 200, fully dialed. Everything's pretty much brand new. Uh, very low hours on the fresh build. Um, it's ready to go too. Fresh dirt bike, KTM 200. It's two stroke season. So get on hostilityinc.com, every order entered, and slabsize.com, every $1 entered for these bikes. All right, so just to show you guys how good this KTM actually runs, we're gonna fire it up. First kick, no throttle. Idle's perfect, runs perfect, literally a brand new bike. Alright guys, thank you for watching the episode. Hit that subscribe button, turn the notifications on, get to hostilityinc.com, buy some gear. Um, all this footage and all this uh, day in and day out lifestyle that we live is all out of pocket. So we really rely on you guys to support the company, support the brand. Um, you want to keep seeing cool shit that I'm doing, get on there, buy a shirt, a hat, a beanie, a, a sweatshirt, whatever it is, um, some stickers. Thank you guys very much. See you on the next episode.